Hi everyone, my name is Victor Brugos and this is the Vantage app. It's a new approach to developer prep. So first we're going to start off by saying what it is. Uh, Vantage is basically a user-friendly uh, mapping app that will take the user on a tour of Gulliver by showing them multiple pictures and giving them a bit of information about Gulliver. So the user will load up the app and they'll basically walk through certain points within Gulliver and gain a little perspective on it. So uh, one of the examples is a, they see an image of the cafeteria and there's a little description that says check out the food by Sage. So as they use the app, they're going through these points, seeing what Gulliver is, maybe gaining perspective on direction as to where they would be in Gulliver, and learning a bit of information about some of these places. So next, the uh, question was posed, who can use it? And the answer is anyone can really use it. Uh, the app is extremely straightforward and it's very user friendly, uh, but really the people who would be using it are anyone who's looking to gain just a little bit more information about the uh, school and what it has to offer. Uh, some of these people would most likely be prospective students, parents, uh, possibly incoming freshmen. And uh, one of the cool things about it is that it's on a mobile device or an, a tablet of some sort. So you could actually, say you're visiting family in a different state or different country, you could actually show them pictures and say, oh look, this is where I go to school, this is you know, this is my library, this is my cafeteria, this is uh, just a little bit of information so you can actually show others your school. That's a little interesting fact. So here's a screenshot of the app. Uh, this is just to show you what it sort of looks like and what it's, what it's going to be doing. So we have the first picture here, it's a startup, and all it is is the Gulliver G and there's a little button that says click to start being Gulliver. So as soon as you start, uh, as soon as you click that, you'll be transferred to another screen which will be the entrance screen and you'll see the entrance to Gulliver and, uh, and such. Uh, but I'll tell you how I programmed it. I used something called the MIT App Inventor 2 which is uh, something that's based for Android devices and uh, it's, it's very simple to use and uh, I use just this simple line of programming that says one button one click do and so what's that saying is when a button is clicked on the app it'll just transfer you to another screen showing you information and a picture of what you're going to be looking at. And so next I'm just going to show you a quick video operation of how it runs. So as you can see, you click on the buttons and it'll show you different images of Gulliver and a couple of, and just a short description of where the place is and what it, what it does and how it serves a purpose. That's pretty much it. Okay, very good. Um, question here for you. Go back to your uh, screenshots of the app in your presentation. Uh, screenshot. Now, would it be difficult, Victor, in addition to a picture and maybe a little caption, would it be difficult to um, hover, if you hover um, over the picture, to give more information, kind of like give it more of an augmented reality feel to it? So, for example, if you click on... Um, one part of the picture, it will give you information. Um, you know, say you say you're in uh, the courtyard. Right. So if you hover over right. the, uh, you know, one part of the of the atrium, right. uh, it'll say, okay, these are where most of the math classes will right. be taking place as you're, you know, when you're a freshman. Yeah. You hover over another part, it'll say, okay, here are the labs for science, mm -hmm. you know, things like that. Yeah. So the so the question was, uh, could it be more interactive and more of an augmented reality so the way this could be done is by on the picture you can add little buttons 
to a portion of the picture, let's say on like a hot spot. Right, like a hot spot. So let's say on this engineering picture, there's a there's a picture of a Dremel in the background. So if there was a button added to the Dremel, right, um, okay. you can say the user could click on this button and then a short description could come up. This is all theoretical. Could come up mm -hmm. and uh, provide a little bit of information on what that is and how right. it serves a purpose. And then, of course, this part right here is where your safety goggles are. Right. So it would give the student who, a prospective engineering student, kind of like a, a little tour of the, of the shop before they go in there and, and get their original, you know, their initial um, view of the, of the shop. Is it, would it be difficult? To no, it wouldn't be very difficult. It would just be adding a little button on there. Okay. Is that something that you feel you may want to take, if you want to take this app to another level, you may want to go in that direction? Yeah. Also, a couple ideas I was having is to make it so that <laughs> you could just visit different locations instead of having this set track where you click a button and you're automatically taken to another location. Right. You could have maybe more sense of direction with uh, arrows pointing to different places and stuff like that. Okay. So that's something you're going to be implementing as well? Right. Okay. All right, good. Any other questions or comments? No. Thanks. That was really good. Yeah. Okay. All righty. Thank you very much, Victor. Good job.